Good morning, everyone, and happy Thanksgiving. So today I'm gonna be bringing you a quick video with my daughter, Olivia. She came with me to work yesterday and she wanted to get her hair pressed for Thanksgiving so she could flex on the family, apparently. So I'm gonna show you guys the process of getting her hair straight and let's get straight to the video. So currently, Olivia's hair is already washed. I'm just finger detangling because her texture tends to tangle up a lot. Um, so we're just making sure to finger detangle and then I'm going to go in the, with my paddle brush and start from the bottom and work my way to the roots just to detangle our hair further. I'm going in with some argan oil. Um, this is a new brand. I'm not sure the exact brand. There was actually a guy who came in and just gave it to me. It was just like, I want you to try this out in your videos. So I'm still testing it out. Don't know if I should recommend it or not, but it's pure argan oil. It's supposed to be, so it should be fine. So now I'm just parting her hair and I'm just detangling a small section before I blow dry. Fun fact, let me throw this in. So I actually do 99% of my voiceovers in my garage because it's the only place in my house that's always quiet at all times. But why am I in here and there's this big ass centipede on the wall and it's throwing me off. <laughs> I couldn't even get through the first part of the voiceover because I was in here stuttering because I was so scared to kill this big motherfucker. But I'm gonna let it live, I'm gonna let it be great. But I just had to throw that out there. So here I'm just blow drying her hair pretty self-explanatory so i'm not going to torture you guys too much i just want to just show you guys a section first and then just a smaller section after that and we're going to skip straight to the press so um for olivia's hair because it is a finer texture i don't need to use a lot of heat in it and i don't need to do super small sections um she's seven so i don't like to be super detailed with her i'm just trying to get it straight so it looks nice for a couple days um she does gymnastics three days a week so i know it's not going to last so i'm just doing something really quick for the holidays i'm not being super intricate i'm just doing me and something that I know that she'll like. Okay, so now she's mostly blow dried out. So what I'm doing is just grabbing those tiny little baby hairs that are in the front that I can never get with the brush. And I'm just pulling them out with my hands and just hitting them with the blow dryer to make sure they're dry. And then I'm going to start pressing her hair. I always spray some S3 spray by Influence in there. It's a heat protectant, it's a UV protectant. It also adds shine to the hair. I don't think I showed that part, but I always put that in before I press. And I'm just pressing her hair. I'm using the Bioionic and my Rusk. Um, I like to switch back and forth between the irons for her hair. Sometimes I'll use one, sometimes I use both. But in this video, I just chose to use both. And now I'm just going in and applying a little bit of Ite, um butter shine on her hair just to give her hair a little bit of shine. And then I'm going to put her middle part in. And then we are going to trim her ends because homegirl needs a trim. It's been about how many months? I don't even know. Her birthday was in June. So it's been since then since we pressed her hair out and trimmed it. I normally let her press her hair for her birthday and the first day of school. So this will actually be her third press this year. But typically, Olivia only gets her hair pressed once a year, and that's for her birthday. And actually, if you guys want, what I can do at the end of this video is insert a few pictures. Olivia, two years ago, almost two years ago, for kindergarten, she wanted to cut her hair off. So we did a big chop in her hair. We actually cut her hair all the way up to her ears. So when it was curly, it was super, super short. But my daughter kept saying, cut more, cut more. I cut it, and then once we wet it, I was like, oh my God. But it has grown back so much since then. So I had just a quick picture at the end so you guys can see her year and a half slash two year growth. But her hair grows like a weed um, because we keep it braided up most of the time and cute little pigtails and little cute girl styles. So she doesn't typically get her hair pressed too much, but I like to press it just so I can trim her ends because sometimes them things be looking raggedy. <laughs> and I want to make sure my baby girl looks right. Okay, so now we are all done the trim and I'm gonna let Olivia flex for you guys. She was feeling it. Um, her hair only made it about 10 seconds before she started messing with it, but you know how little kids are. So thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to your girl's channel and I will be back in the future. Everyone have a wonderful and amazing Thanksgiving.